Iburu, Iboya, Abuche, everybody in Cyberland. Hey, so it's Friday. My mind's wandering. I'm thinking about this weekend. And then I think about the federal U.S. holiday called Memorial Day. And, uh, and it kind of makes me think. And I want to kind of just share a couple of thoughts. Everything, when I look at the world, okay, I look at everything very much in spiritual lenses, right? My Gauri kind of opens my eyes up, I think, a lot more than what it used to be many, many years ago. Um, so I look at Memorial Day, and the first thing I think is, King Ben Tunu. All right? King Ben Tunu. For many of you who don't know, maybe you do know, right? May you rest in peace. And we say Kim Ben Tunu a lot. But a lot of people don't truly understand that when when we invoke our egos and we and we light them up and we acknowledge them, that's memorializing them, right? Memorial Day. Uh, when the United States made a federal holiday, Memorial Day, is to memorialize those who have fallen for this country. And it makes me think. We memorialize not only within our faith, but within our country. All right? And that goes for all countries, because all countries have struggled. But let's go back to the spiritual aspect of things. King Ben Dunn. We invoke those who have came before us because at one point in time, they established what we have today. We talk about La Regla de Ocha. And we talk about how the slaves came and they created something from that that was new. It was new. And it, and it was new only because when the times came for the Africans in Nigeria to come together was when they became slaves. When they were all on the same boat together. They were, all, they were on the same island together. And they created something that was beautiful. La Regla de Ocha. That's why, you know, a lot of people, you know, must recognize that Ocha is not from Africa. Ocha is not. That's something that was created in Cuba. It is what it is. And it works. And it walks. So we memorialize those things. We memorialize those slaves. We, we memorialize those Africans that did what they did to give us what we have today. Now, Ifa is different. Ifa is more on the aspect of we do have the African roots and we still do things very traditional to what the African roots have. We have a flavor of things. Why? Because we were able to diversify. Because when we look at Memorial Day and we look at what we've been able to establish and we thank our egos, we forget that diversity is huge. Diversity is just not the aspect of a couple of people getting together um, and then we have people who, who have babies and they're mixed babies. And, and no, 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 forget all that. Today, it's very rare that you're going to find somebody of 100% pure bloodline. Because it's diversity that helped us evolve. So we memorialize and we, and we think about Memorial Day. We got to think about some of those aspects. Okay, and Ifa. Ifa has given us that. Ifa has linked Africa to Cuba to the rest of the world. Why? Because Ifa is Ifa. Ifa started there and, and, and our roots still there. Um, Ocha, the roots are from Cuba. We have to recognize that. The Egungs never change because the Egungs are forever. The divinities are always been here. We just learn to recognize them differently. That's Memorial Day. Thinking back on how we got to where we are today in this faith because that's beautiful. The information age has helped us evolve. Thinking and remembering how we got here. That's Memorial Day. But well, spiritually speaking, there's more to that. So, to all the Egos. To my lineage. Especially for my Godfather, Chetura, Miguel Alvarez Barrera. Just want to kind of share that with you guys. And this is just a short video because I think it's very important. And Memorial Day is not about just barbecues and drinking and having a great time. But let's think and let's focus and let's give thanks to where we need to give thanks. Which is always going to be to the Eguns, the Orishas, the Ochas. Okay? Mafarafun, lo Egun, mafarafun, lo Orishas, mafarafun, la Ocha.
with that set. Iburu, Iboya Bucheche, short video, something I was thinking about. And I just wanted to make sure that you guys would think of what I was thinking. Again, leave comments, like, share, la regla de ifa at gmail. That's la dot regla dot de dot ifa. Everything in this world is done and can be tied back into your spiritual faith, which is 100% the key to success. With that said, Iburu Boa Bucheche, Cyberland.